the coolest reviews, the funnest shit, nailing the fuck out of it every damn day of the week. It's Grim's Toy Show Action Inside a Figure Review. I am your host, Ebenezer Middle Store. It's time for the review. The review time is now. Today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Mattel Elite Superstar Series 33 X-Pac. First time in the line. Are you at your damn mind? Drugs not included. Degeneration X Stop. And a European Championship. Right next to the new logo, ho. Grim grabbed this figure from WrestlingFigures.com. The bullshit on the back of the box features the motherfucker all like, ah! <laughs> if I had a big bulge in my shorts like him, I'd be all like, ah, too. <laughs> He's got all kinds of information down the side of a package. Yeah, signature move, X-Factor, drug of choice, crystal meth, former affiliations, New World Order, Recap, China, and the other five fucks available in the set. Holy go filter fish. The first thing I noticed when I took the figure out of the packaging is the European Championship belt has no logo ho. Which makes perfect sense. Because you couldn't put the new logo ho on an old championship belt. Everybody would have bitched and complained times 12. So they gave it no logo ho, which is fucking hilarious. European. <laughs> I'm a poopin'. X Pac and X Box are both black and green. Coincidence? I think not, if you know what I mean. This is his face. He's got two words for you. What the? <laughs> Old ass 90s joke. Why the hell is he wearing a tissue around his fucking forehead? Aren't you supposed to blow your nose in handkerchiefs? What a waste. X-Pac and China were part of Degeneration X. But when these two bastards got behind closed doors with a video camera, it became Degeneration XXX. On the bottom of his black kick pads, it says Made in China. Similarly, on his dick, it says Came in China. Nailed it. You can barely see the grease running out of his hair, streaming down his back, and funneling into his ass crack. He's got some type of green stripe growth chart running up the sides of his wrestling trunks, a little DX logo, and black knee pads. And look, don't go getting cute and thinking you could take the knee pads off, because the green paint stripe stops a pubic hair under the pad. I can't believe he got a tattoo of one cross. I mean, after all the times that people have turned heel on him, you would think he would be feeling a little bit double-crossed. Double nailed it. Finally, this X-Pac figure comes with this fucking terrible rubber degeneration X-Bib. It's complete and utter bullshit and a complete and utter waste of rubber. He should have came with this little tiny video camera. This way, he could have made a sequel to his first hit feature film, One Night in China. He could have called it Three Months in Rehab. Nailed it. Thank you for watching our show and welcome to Team Nailed It. Don't forget to check out our website, GrimstoyShow.com. Buy all your wrestling figures at WrestlingFigures.com. Use discount code Grim at checkout to save 10%. There's a link in the description. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe. Boa, moa, nailed it.